All right, this is a, one of our hatch cover manipulator uh, prototypes. How it works is it's got um, two pieces of hook side Velcro that attaches to the loop side of the hatch cover and uh, two pistons that force it off the Velcro. All right, let's get it shot. That actually worked. So in about a few hours, we made a copy of the field gate, uh, the field loading station, but it also works uh, on the flip side as, once we add some Velcro, as a cargo uh, shuttle uh, doorway, um, or at least it's also the right size to throw the ball in. Um, and we were testing to see how easy it was just to use Velcro to pull the disc our makeshift disc out of the um, initial loading zone and it sits pretty comfortably um, in our initial test it might just be our velcro but it, it seems to come out it definitely comes out it doesn't really stay on so we'll see well it is a product of surface area so you could always just add more Yeah, but we're we're contacting all the Velcro that we can. No. There is well, so many. You, oh, can, yeah. you can add more distance along the circumference. Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, so like if it, but that also makes it harder to get rid of. Okay, so now we're going to try the hatch cover manipulator, uh, putting it onto the hatch cover receptacle. Uh, so here goes. We're gonna so driving up, miming putting it on there. And releasing. How does it feel to you when it when it triggers? It feels like it pops right off. Okay. Whatever. Or not. Why is it? Could you go back to back, pull it from the uh, wall, and then score it? Uh, no, because the Velcro here is holes resistant. This is a. Uh, Oh, but actually, like I suppose flip it around. Yeah, you just flip it. Anyway, well, it's, it's, it's attached to yours right now, so pop it. Okay. Okay, so now we're going to try like a full prototyping, a full cycle. So here we've got the Mime Human Player uh, station. So we're going to come up, grab it from there, pull it off, which isn't perfect yet, and then uh, place it. and release.